name is Clay. Will you create with me today? Come join the creation station and think. Hello there, friends. My name is Clay, and I want to welcome you to the creation station. We call this the creation station because God is a creative God. So that means we are creative too because he made us to be like him. Oh, I forgot to introduce you to my friends, Buttons and Dot. Heidi ho my name is Buttons, and this is my friend Dot. We are so excited to have you join us. Yeah, we are. And I was thinking, would you like to be makers with us today? Yes. Yes. Dot, that's a great idea. I love the way you think. Uh, before we start this craftastic day, everyone stand up and let's sing a song together. Oh, what, what fun. fun. You sounded amazing! You can take a seat. When we craft and create together here, there are two rules we follow. Can you tell our new makers the rules of Creation Station? Of course we can, Clay! Boys and girls, let me see you wave one hand and say, Be kind! Be, be kind! kind. We can be kind by staying quiet so we can hear each other and not miss any instructions for our special projects. That's right! Now, let me see you wave two hands and say, Be safe! Be, be safe. safe! We can be safe by keeping our hands and craft tools to ourselves and staying in our seats so we don't mess up anyone's creation. That's it! Easy peasy! Oh, did you hear that, Buttons and Dot? Colorful crayons, I sure did. Makers, that sound means we have another maker friend who wants to show us the creation they've been working on. That's right, let's check it out and see what's crafting. Hey Clay, hey Buttons and Dot, my name is AJ. Today at school we had such a fun day talking about pets. Some kids in my class have pets like dogs, cats, fish, birds, and even guinea pigs. But I don't have a pet, and all day I was so sad. But my teacher told us that we can make our own pet, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a pet rock. Ta-da! 
It's really cute, but it's just not the same as a real pet. It can't move or even eat. Ugh. Oh no! I love AJ's new pet rock, but we need to help him with what he's thinking. You're right, Dot. Friends, to help AJ, we need to put on our thinking caps. To finish sewing our thinking caps, what do we need? Glue or thread? Thread! That's right! Everyone hold up your needle and thread! Now, let's finish sewing our thinking caps. We did it! Now, everyone reach up and grab your thinking cap and put it on. What, what am I thinking? What am I thinking? Catch it. Check it. Change it. Right now. Catch it. Check it. Change it. You can catch any thought you have. And you can check it with what God says is right and true. If you're not sure, just ask him. Then, if your thought doesn't match what God says, let him help you change it. Catch it, check it, change it. That's it! AJ needs to catch his thought. We do that by asking, what am I thinking? Makers, was AJ thinking sad things because he doesn't have a real pet? If you think so, nod your head like this. That's exactly what AJ was thinking. Now, we need to help him check that thought with what God says. I think we do that by reading God's word. Right, Clay? Right, Aruni. Do you boys and girls know what God's word is? The Bible. That's right. Makers, let's get ready to hear a story from the Bible by clicking on our listening ears. Click, click. click. Now, let's put on our special eyes. Zoop, zoop, zoop. You look ready now. Check this out. This is Nabal. He had a lot of money, a lot of land, and so many animals, like 1,000 goats, 3,000 sheep, and so many more. And this is David. One day, as David was traveling with his soldiers near where Nabal lived, they started to run low on supplies. David remembered a time when he had helped Nabal keep his animals safe. So he thought Nabal would be happy to help him by giving David and his soldiers food to eat and water to drink. However, when Nabal heard David's request for help, he acted as if he had never met David. He only thought about himself, and he refused to share anything with David. When David heard this, he became very angry. It seemed like David wanted to get back at Nabal and be mean to him too. Both David and Nabal weren't thinking good things. One of Nabal's servants knew that what he was doing wasn't right, so he went to find Abigail, Nabal's wife. Abigail was a very kind and caring woman. Nabal's servant told her everything that had happened. He asked her to think it over to see if she could help. Abigail thought about what was best and acted quickly. She saddled up her donkey and went out to meet David and his men, who were coming for Nabal with swords. When Abigail saw David, she fell at his feet and apologized for her husband's unkind actions. She also gave David and his men some sheep, 200 loaves of bread, 300 cakes, and so much more. David gave praise to God for Abigail's kindness to him. Her good thinking kept David from doing what was wrong. When we have a thought that's wrong, God can help us catch it, check it, and change it to something that is good. With God's help, we can think about good things, just like Abigail. Say this after me. Think about, think about good things. Good things. 
That's it. Makers, God can help us think about what is good. Let's tell AJ how to check his sad thought with what God says is good. How do we know what God says? Well, we can pray and ask him. And remember, we can look in the Bible. But the Bible is a big book. How do we know where to find something that will help? That's a great question, Dot. You can ask a grown-up to help. Good idea. Clay, you're a grown-up, so can you help? You know it. Here's something in God's Word that will change AJ's sad thoughts about not having a pet like his friends. It says, a happy heart is like good medicine. AJ, did you hear that? I sure did. Thinking happy and good thoughts helps me just like medicine helps me when I feel sick. But what happens if I start thinking thoughts that are not good again? Well, you can remember that verse from God's Word. And you can ask God to help you think about what's good. Oh yeah, I can do that. You guys close your eyes and pray with me. Hey God, please help me think about good things. I love you, amen. Thank you, Clay and Buttons and Dot. Bye. Bye. Looky there. AJ can think about good things and so can you. I wanna hear you say this after me. Think about. Think about. Good things. Good things. Makers, you did it. You helped AJ know how he can catch it, check it, and change it. Are you two thinking what I'm thinking? I'm thinking about yummy gummy worms. Is that what you're thinking? No, but that does sound really yummy. I think we need to celebrate with a song. Me too. Makers, let's stand up and sing. Great job, makers! That was so fun! But the fun is not done. I think it's time for us to play a great game. Colorful crayons! Let's play! Okay, makers, see if you can find two matching pictures. Do you think these two pictures match? No! What about these? Are they a match? No. Do these two pictures match? Yes. This match has a question for us. It asks, in our story, did Nabal have good thoughts or mean thoughts? Mean thoughts. Right, Aruni. Nabal was thinking mean thoughts. Those mean thoughts made David start thinking mean thoughts too. 
But God helped Abigail think about good things. And when she shared her good thoughts with David, he started thinking about good thoughts too. Let's find another match. Are these pictures matching? No. What about these two? Are they a match? Yes. This match has a question for us too. It asks, if AJ wants to think about good things, should he think about not having a pet or think about his pet rock? His pet rock. You got it, makers. AJ may not have a pet like his friends, but he can think about the amazing pet rock he made. And if you start thinking sad things, God wants to help you think good things too. Let me hear you say this after me. Think about. Think about. Good things. Good things. Good job, everybody. Whenever a thought pops into your mind, remember that God can help you. And so can our song. Makers, sing along with us. What am I thinking? What am I thinking? Catch it. Check, Check it. it. Change, Change it. Right, right now. That was perfect. Makers, as you go through your week, remember that God wants to help you change the way you think. And we will see you all next week. Bye-bye.